<clears throat> Ready to talk to me? Here I am. What did you need? I'm Ronnie Shaw, Commonwealth Minutemen. At least I was. Back before Joe Becker got himself killed and the idiots took over. Joe Becker? Who's that? That's just sad. General Becker used to run the Minutemen. The last real leader we ever had. After he died, there wasn't anybody left with the guts and brains to pull things together. I'd still like to hear what you came to talk to me about. Heard you were trying to get the Minutemen back on their feet. Thought I'd come see the new general for myself. So what's your story? What makes you think anybody even wants the Minutemen back? The Commonwealth needs the Minutemen. People are starting to realize that. I've heard some good things. Wouldn't be here otherwise. Now that I'm here, I can see you really need my help. We can always use more experienced soldiers. Yeah, you're not kidding. But I had something more specific in mind. And I'm probably the only one who still remembers this. But the castle's armory was located in the West Bastion. And all of our best equipment was stored there. Weapons, ammo, schematics, you name it. Come on, I'll show you. still be intact. Door still sealed. Bastion hasn't collapsed. Trick now is finding a way in. I hope you have an idea. Of course I do. If you can't go through, go around. Let's have a look at the northeast bastion. leading from here to the armory. Hmm, the tunnel's blocked by this rubble. We'll have to find some way to clear it. Let's get down there and... see if there's still a way through. Pretty dark down here. We better watch our step.
castle since uh, forever, as far as I know. Now. United we stand. Yeah, that was it. Ah, that explains all the landmines. This is, well, was, General McGann. He had your job back when I first joined him. Must have gotten trapped down here when that sea beast attacked the castle. Uh, he did manage to keep the armory secure. I'll give him that much. Ah, guess the uniform is yours now, if you want it. This old geezer doesn't need it anymore. Rest in peace, General. Your fight is done, and the Minutemen live on. <laughs> There's no point in getting all sentimental about something that happened 40 years ago. Come on, we're almost through. To admit, Ronnie, having artillery would help out quite a bit. Oh, we used to rain down fire on death claws and super mutants alike. It was a glorious thing. All right, let's get going. Don't forget to grab some smoke grenades too. Hey there. Ah, looks like you've got everything we need. As soon as you get some artillery built, we'll do a test fire to calibrate it. <laughs> 